Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, let me congratulate Millie, great lady who is now the whip from the minority side. I think you deserve it in no ways. You've contributed a lot to this house and the country, and we will cherish as you continue to serve us. Thank you. As regards uh, our position, the term broad-based government, and the word government is a term of art. It refers to the executive. It does not refer to this house at all. So the position remains what has always been prevalent here. We have the majority side and the minority side, and the positions of leadership remain as they have always been. Uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker, uh, for giving me this chance so that I first of all congratulate our senior here, Honorable Miri Odiabo. Thank you so much for portraying your capacity to carry out the task that you were given. But uh, Mr. Speaker, uh, if it were not for just getting this time to debate a point that already has an answer, I want to say and I want to support uh, my colleague here that the issue of broad-based is a word that came or a statement that came from the executive. It has no legal basis when it comes to our parliamentary work that we are supposed to do. So, Mr. Speaker, to me, it is within the starting orders that we have the majority whip and the minority uh, side. And therefore, my dear sister and colleague, uh, continue being the minority whip Thank, thank you. Don't the member for Nambale.